Good morning. It's been a while. And the video light is on. It's really bright. Anyway, my eyes. Um, I'd say like, how you doing? But that's just silly. I've um, it's been a bit of a gap. Say. Um, there's been a bit of a gap in my video blogging because um, I haven't had my car. Uh, it's been in uh, the dealer having things done, and um, I've had a bit of a. Oh, you know, sometimes when you just start self-doubting, and so I haven't really trained as much, <sighs> and that happens sometimes, and I've been really down and out of it. But back to normal, I haven't done any harm, so yeah, here we go. So today is a bit of a different one. I'm um, I've, I I uh, I finished the weight routine. Um, I think on the last session, and then you saw a session with me and Sammy, who kicked my ass. Uh, today I'm just doing uh, running. I'm doing um, some endurance. That, that bloody mud 10k thing is coming up in two days' time. So I'm just doing some conditioning and um, just getting my pace up so I'm, I'm nice and, and I'm warmed up and ready for it. Um, so I'm training today then I'm having tomorrow off to get be fully rested for, for, for Saturday and then Saturday is just going to be shit. It's going to rain and it's muddy and I'm going to be so, so miserable and pissed off doing this thing. And the thing is, it's like a party weekend as well, so there's lots of alcohol and drinking. I'm not doing that because I'm on my 90 day challenge. I can't really blow that with um, excessive amounts of alcohol. So I'm going to be chilling in the, in the tent with my Kindle while everybody else is lodging it big in the beer tent with beer. times yeah so I've just had this um, and I think perhaps everyone gets this I've had this malady where we've had a bank holiday weekend and it was lovely and I was really 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 busy working on the house pretty much finished the little studio at home now so I can start video blogging from home my camera is still creaking so I had a very, very active weekend, but I haven't eaten that well. I haven't eaten badly, badly. I haven't like fallen off the rails, but I've eaten a bit more crap than I normally would have. Um, and that makes me, and that made me realise just how easy it'll be to fall back to my old ways. And now that I've come to where I am, and I'm good with the eating and I'm good with the exercise I was a little bit depressed at how easily I could fall back to my old habits I, it really oh, it really bothered me so um, yeah I've probably in a bit of a funk to be honest what can you say important part is as I've said before just put it behind get on with it that's what that's what my coach has said don't it's gonna happen it's gonna happen again it'll happen again and again and especially I think I've been so big for such a long time and I've tried so many ways to to get the weight off and failed you just feel as if you're never gonna achieve it you're never going to to, you're always going to fail at it, um, you know. I haven't weighed. I'm not sure how much I weigh. Although 
I did go out to a, a restaurant which I go to occasionally last night and um, there was a, a noticeable gap between my belly and the um, table <laughs> which is growing increasingly and I've always sort of had to squeeze into these booths because I'm you know pretty big so um, so that's nice to see that growing and my clothes my um, the jeans I put a post on Facebook with yay retro jeans that I haven't, I haven't been able to fit into for years I put those on yesterday and they're falling off so I've gone from jeans which are too small to jeans which fit which jeans are now too big in just a few weeks so that's good, yeah. And that's, you know, that's more important than the scales, I guess. But the scales are still the easiest measure for me at the moment. Cardio session incoming. Hello. Good news. I absolutely destroyed my 5K time. That's twice now. I've done, I've done a 5K out of, you know, just for a change. And, um obliterated my previous time left left my previous time upstairs crying and I'm not even tired and I had plenty more in the tank don't know whether I'm getting fitter or just because the weight is coming off the um, it's getting easier don't know <laughs> good times I don't think I'm ever gonna be a runner and the Sun is in my eyes I've also discovered why my camera creaks and it's because it's got a plastic base plate which creaks so that's annoying right but yeah uh, 5k smashed it absolutely smashed it and I was comfortable at the halfway mark at the 5k mark so I'll easily do um I'll easily have a 10k in the back too and that's good but I think 10k maybe half marathons the Disney half I think those are going to be my that's it, I don't ever run marathons, I just want to do, you know, fun runs and slightly longer fun runs. The Disney half is fantastic. I wouldn't mind doing a Disney coast to coast maybe, which is when you do all the Disney parks across, you know, you do California and you do Florida and, and a, you know, a bunch of others. So, um, that's good. That's really good. It cheered me up no end. I haven't weighed, you see, as I mentioned earlier. So I don't know how the weight is doing this week. I'm away on Sunday. Because I've been out of my normal training plan, because I'm just prepping for the, the mud run, I'm kind of right. So, which is, I, I kind of forgot about all this when I started the length of day challenge. I forgot I had this bloody mud run in the middle of it, which is just throwing everything off. Um, but never mind. Never mind, a lot, a lot of calories burned on the, on the 10k itself, climbing over rubber things, throwing my friends over rubber walls. Not sure how many walls I'm going to climb myself, to be honest. Not really built for climbing, truth be told, but I'm pretty well built for throwing my friends over the walls. So, you know, teamwork. And, um, yeah, let's see how that goes. But then I'm not going to be doing the beer tents and, the, and the, all of that. I, I don't want to waste the calories, to be honest. So, uh, yeah, Kindle time. That creek, though. So it's the very bottom of the mount. I wonder if there's a way I can um, fix that. Mm. All right then, short one today. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. I, I don't know, even know where the subscribe button is going to be, but click it, please. And, um, yeah, so please, yeah, click that subscribe button and uh, join in on the, uh, this, this <laughs> horrendous journey of running and lifting tin and losing weight and not eating much. Yeah, good times. Bye, all.